Hi, Jonathan York from Investment Research Group, uh, looking at the investment markets ahead. Um, obviously a very uh, volatile week last week and we expect uh, further volatility this week. Um, still great uncertainty within the equity markets, uh, but it's just worthwhile noticing that um, if you look at certainly in the US now, um, the current uh, price activity in uh, the, uh, the US shares has priced in approximately a 15% fall in earnings. That does make uh, the earnings season now, sort of October, November, very interesting because we're still at these levels. Um, the market has already priced in a fall in earnings of around 15%. Now, obviously, if you don't get that uh, corresponding fall in earnings, um, it does make some of these shares uh, particularly attractive on the on price earnings ratio. So it does make it very important to, uh, to uh, try and look at the bigger picture here. Um, obviously this week uh, in the US we've got uh, the, the annual Fed meeting at uh, Jackson Hole and it'll be very interesting to see what comes out of that if indeed anything does. Um, still uh, further mutings out there about uh, QE3 and it'll just be interesting to see if anything does uh, really, uh, really come out of that. Um, domestically, again, uh, you know, you, you really need to be looking at the bigger picture. Um, we're now in the middle of earnings season uh, here in New Zealand, and we've seen some pretty, uh, pretty encouraging earnings uh, coming out from some of the, uh, the larger companies. Um, Fletcher Building, Newplex, Telecom, um, Port of Tarawa have all performed particularly well, and uh, their earnings were certainly uh, a little bit ahead of, uh, ahead of schedule. Um, but given the sell-off you'd seen in the equity markets, um, which didn't really relate to the, uh, the earnings, You've seen quite a marked uh, pickup in these shares coming back now, and we've seen about a four or five percent rally uh, on the back of the earnings news coming out from these companies. So I say it is important to be looking at the bigger picture, and uh, just just bear in mind why you're actually buying the buying the company and looking at their earnings rather than just getting caught up in the general um, sort of fear that seems to be taking place in the market at the present. Air New Zealand also announced uh, late last week uh, that there is a potential for a bond offer um, in, the, uh, in the very near future. Um, now if you do have any interest in uh, potential fixed interest, um, call us on 0800 867 323 um, just to uh, register your interest. And then as soon as we get uh, details of the bond offering, if indeed it does come through, um, we can then forward those to you. Disclosure statement available on request. Uh, you can go to uh, www.irgbop.co.nz. Lots of interesting articles. I look forward to speaking to you soon.